getting rid of that. Getting rid of that. New pipe cover on that. That's it. I love it. Georgia. Sweet Georgia peach. So, most importantly, we got a five foot mark. Four foot mark, excuse me. <laughs> Sorry, Paul. We got our uh, four foot mark here with our six inch overhang here. Um, we measured back from here to the end. Nope. From here to the end for our first sheet. And then from here to the end for our second sheet. Chris has them ready. That'll be our second row across. Billy and I are getting ready to start popping lines um, for the plywood while they start plywooding down there. Rock and roll. glue down acrylic water-based bonding adhesive you can put this stuff on the rubber and on the right there be good right there and uh, make it a contact yes sir make it a contact cement but we don't need to do that the only time we use that is in what transitions right Two by fours are on all the way around the outside for the sub patient. All the rubber has been glued down. We have one, two more seams to do. Seams being here. This one here to do. Yeah, it's fine. is in the dry. So, we're getting ready to pop some lines on this thing. So we know where to lay our plywood and we're going to continue just like what they got going on over there up here so when we get there guys beginning everybody you know what this thing's gonna look like when we're finished Anytime, anytime we have a transition, we always run our rubber over and then double seam right here so that won't come unstick from the two before down there. That's tight. And then this piece goes over the top of that. And it will get 
combination bar right here all the way down through there never have another leak on your mobile home porch transition between the house and the trailer never Even better. Even better. Come on down, look at the end. Nice finish.